Hi guys, it's Ben from Kind Health again, and we've got a new question for the day. This question is, how do I compare uh, insurance plans? So, first of all, before we tackle that question, I think there's a couple of really important things to understand when it comes to choosing a plan. First of all, be aware that it doesn't matter where you go to shop, the plan, the plan prices are the same wherever you go. These are set by the insurance companies and then regulated by the government. Second of all, be aware that the plans that you qualify for are based off of three uh, specific details. First of all, one being your age, so your date of birth. Two, where you live, state, county, and zip code. And thirdly, whether or not you use any tobacco products, smoking or chewing, or anything else that falls between those brackets. Now, when it comes to actually comparing plans, I think the most important things to bear in mind are the, the three costs. First of all, your premium, which is your monthly payment to actually have the plan. Second of all, your deductible. That is the amount of money that you pay before your coinsurance kicks in and starts helping pay for things like doctor's visits and surgeries. Thirdly, is your out-of-pocket maximum. The out-of-pocket maximum is the amount of money that you will pay, um, total amount that you'll pay, until the, the plan will cover 100% of the cost. So for example, if my deductible is $1,400, I will pay that and then my coinsurance will kick in. For example, again, my coinsurance could be 80-20, which means the insurance company will pay 80% of the bill and I will pay 20%. Then I will have to pay up to my out-of-pocket maximum. Let's say my out-of-pocket maximum is $5,000. I will pay, continue to pay 20% of my bills until it hits $5,000 and then my insurance will pay 100% of the bills. I think that's it, but if you have any more questions, hit us up on Twitter at Kind Cares and we'll be glad to answer any of those.